DistroKid is a distribution service that will get your music on online stores and streaming services such as Spotify, iTunes, Apple Music, Pandora, YouTube, and many more. You can get unlimited uploads of your music for a yearly subscription fee starting at just $19.99. They do not take a commission. You get to keep 100% of your sales and royalty. One thing I like is that they will do payment splits so you can easily pay collaborators on your songs. That's a big deal to me. I've used DistroKid and I know several of my artist friends use it as well and they are all very happy with their service. You can try it now. Use the link in the description below to get 7% off your first year with DistroKid. Welcome to MusicMoveIt.com, I am Torio, and today it's Send Me Music Friday, episode 46. Thank you for tuning in everyone. If you haven't yet, please subscribe, and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Now let's get started. First up is a hip-hop artist named Little Will, and the song is called So Icy. Let's hear a quick clip. I'm a motherfucking Eskimo. I'm a motherfucking Eskimo like Goo I'm a motherfucking Eskimo like Lil Quill. I'm a motherfucking Eskimo like Young Ma. I'm a motherfucking Eskimo like Hood Rich. I'm a motherfucking Eskimo like Rallo. I'm getting money. I'm an Eskimo like Filthy Rich. See money. This slower tempo track is bass heavy and will have your head bopping in no time. He flows well with the track, and it's not bad a song at all but not really breaking any new ground at the same time. I did enjoy it though overall. Here are my scores. Next up is Strange Graphs, and the song is called The Vampire Is Always Right. Let's hear a sample. This electronic song reminds me of a video game soundtrack. It's very unique and interesting to say the least. Not really my cup of tea, but I do respect what the artist did put together. Y'all listen, let me know what you think in the comments. Here are my scores. Next up is a group called Ridiculous Tricks, and the song is called Surrender. Let's hear a quick sample. Surrender is a pretty cool song. It has an 80s feel to it, and the singer fits the song nicely. Sometimes the drummer and the guitar seem a bit out of sync. But besides that, I did enjoy it. Y'all let me know what you think in the comments. Here are my scores. Next up is an artist named Jason Stabs, and the song is called Top Court Shit. Let's hear a quick sample. This has a hard hitting beat. It's very well produced and well executed. Jason flows well and I really did enjoy this song a lot. Y'all listen, let me know what you think in the comments. Here are my scores on this one. Next up is the artist named Lady Pandora and the song is called Zla. Let's hear a quick sample. You know, this song drew me in instantly. It is well produced, the beat makes you want to move, she flows tight, and it's just a fun song overall. Y'all listen, let me know what you think in the comments about it, and here are my scores. Now, here are my top three of the week. So that'll do it for this week. I hope you enjoyed the music. Let me know what you think in the comments. Also, if you want your song reviewed on this Friday show, go down in the description and look all the way at the bottom and there are instructions on what you need to do to get your song to me. I appreciate you watching and I'll see you next video.